Man. Ah. Uh, what was that quest called? I don't even remember. I don't even know what that quest was called. I'm not going to find it in here. I could scroll down through here. What the hell was that quest called? Cave of Dreams. <laughs> Gosh. Um. Let's see. So, anyway, I don't even know if we read the starting of this. L Lugos, Jarl of Clan Drummond, might indeed have been as mad as they said, but when the need arose, he could calculate as coolly as the sanest of men. When Geralt was brought before him to be tried, he resisted any howls for blood braying in his unhinged mind, and instead let the Witcher go, thus banking himself a debt of gratitude with a man well able to repay it. He then transferred that credit to his son, sending Geralt off to help Blue Boy Lugos traverse the nightmarish Cave of Dreams. According to the legend, those foolhardy enough to enter the Cave of Dreams must confront what they fear most. Sometimes the past returns to haunt them. Others, the future prema prematurely exposed, strikes terror in their hearts. Geralt, Lugos, and their companions knew they must fortify their courage to face such a challenge, and so prior to penetrating the cave's bowels, put themselves into a trance using a mixture of hallucinogenic herbs. This concoction proved all too potent. Even Geralt, who had imbibed more psychoactive substances than most men have milk, soon lost all contact of reality. After a bumper crop of wild adventures, many of which, to be frank, I have a hard time believing actually took place, Geralt awoke in the same place where he had earlier partaken of the brain-addling herbs. He expected young Lugos, fresh from the same experience, to bid him a fond farewell. Yet the young warrior had in the meantime discovered Geralt was obliged to help him as repayment for a debt, and yet still had demanded payment for his services. Lugos gave him the promised gold, but it was clear that Geralt, though substantially richer, had lost the respect of Clan Drummond's heir. Oh my gosh. That did not even cross my freaking mind, man. Ah, oh, that just sucks. Doggone it. Well. Man. Ah. <laughs> oh, I'm really bothered by that. All right, Blue Boy Lugos. Madman Lugos' sole child and heir was a dour, strapping lad who was nothing like his father. His nickname dated from his childhood when bruises often covered his body, supposedly from the rough and rowdy play Skellige boys engage in. Yet others suspected they came from his father's belt, rod, or fists, for rumor had it Lugos Sr. did not wish to spoil his only child and thus punished him harshly for any minor cock-up or grander failure. The events Geralt witnessed in the Cave of Dreams confirmed rumors of Lugos' troubled relationship with his father. Blue Boy's greatest fear turned out to be the madman in his family tree. Gosh, dang it. Oh, I'm so bothered by this. Well, shoot. Yeah. <sighs> well... <clears throat> what are we to do? Wow, look at all these places way out here in the water. How am I supposed to get to them without a boat? I mean, there's no boats nearby. Jeez, I mean, there's a boat here, but damn, that's a lot of sailing. Hmm. Ah, I'm just, I'm just sick. <laughs> but I screwed that up. Doggone it. Well, what are you going to do? What are you going to do? We need to get back to one of these two places so we could fast travel somewhere and decide what quest we're going to do next. Uh, contracts? Do we have any low-level contracts? Um, not really. So we'll look at our secondary quests. The Family Blade. Look for a thieves' camp near the obelisk. Should we do that one? Then, okay, these two we won't be able to complete until we get back to Novigrad. So, I guess let's do this one. It's the lowest one we've got. Skelligers value three things above all else. Honor, the memory of their ancestors, and sturdy weapons. That is why Croc on Crate flew into a fury when he found out someone had stolen his family blade, Kuliu, from the care-trolled treasure room. 
The infuriated Jarl promised a fat bounty to whoever could find his lost sword and punish the thief. Where does this one take place? Way up here. So let us travel to Holmsteam's port, and then we will fast travel to here. Well, maybe to uh, Ronveig. Ronveig? And uh, we'll look at this notice board, and then we'll travel up here and uh, see if we can't figure out what happened to this sword. Uh, loot. There's some florins here for some reason. And, uh, oh, those Neckers we killed are still here, so let's help ourselves to their loot. Blood, claw, and heart. Heart, claw, and liver. Uh, saliva and tongue. Blood. Okay. Yeah, alright. Let's... Get out of here, I guess. Loot. Um, 26 mushrooms? Damn. Okay, whatever. That was weird. Oh, come on, girl. You can get out of here. Let's do it. Come on now. Oh, man. Hmm. Yeah. We really screwed that up. Damn. Big time. Let's see, how do we get out of here? How do we get out of here? Gather these ingredients, why not? Uh, okay, there's a road right here. Let's uh, call on our trusty horse. He comes up from the sea. Do you have a good swim, Roach? Okay. All right. Oh my gosh, what is in the woods here? Just wolves, maybe? Wolves. We don't need to fight the wolves. So I'm just going to kind of run through the countryside here. And kind of aim in the right direction. Is that somebody sitting there? Let's see what's going on here. Some dude sitting here. Is he dead? I guess he's dead. A mace. Really? No. And hornworts. Really? That's it? And a dumpling. Alright, some dude just just keeled over dead here, I guess. What's this? Runestone and some florins. Verbena. Glyph and an amethyst. What a strange little place. Huh, another wall up here. I think there's anything interesting up here by this wall. Huh, there's some plants. Alright. Okay, well, nothing going on, really. Let's go back and, uh... Hop on Roach and, uh... We'll be on our way. That was really strange. Let's go, Roach. Come on. Well, we still got some... Still got a ways to go now. Uh-oh. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What the hell is that thing? Jeez. That was scary. Let's just keep moving, shall we? Uh-oh. 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 How do we get past this ridge here? Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa. Oh, no. Oh, we're back here again. That's it, Roach. Ooh, good job, Roach. I'm gonna hop off of Roach now, because these steps are sometimes a little hard to navigate on a horse. So we'll just run down these ourselves and help ourselves to Winestone and Powdered Pearl, Dwarven Spirit and Powdered Pearl. What's going on back here? This looks suspicious, right? A chest. Runestone silver, a manuscript page for superior black blood, trousers, essence. Okay. Cool. Pretty neat. Clan Drummond. So I wonder if he's angry with us now. No. It would have been neater if they were like all like unfriendly Torah us now because of what we did and how 
maybe like word got around of what we did. But apparently not. Boat right. What's going on? Oh. Okay. Alright. Let's leave him alone. Where is this fast travel point? Is it up there? What the hell? How the hell are you on the ground? I guess he's taking a nap or something? Weird. What's in here? Have we been in here? Um, I don't know if this is somebody's home or what. I don't think that we need to go looting. We're already hated enough here. Drummond Shield Maiden? Okay. Hello. Hello. Alright. Fast travel points. Fast travel to... I said to... Where? Up here. To Ronvag. Fast travel here. We'll look at the notice board. See if there's any quests on it. Uh, ooh, there's a quest right here. Let's go check this out. Auden. What is it? You're, you're clearly a fighting man with many journeys neath your belt. Yeah, you can say that. I'm in need of your help. You see, it's me Sonny. I'm worried. Left home a fortnight back and hasn't returned. Will you see what's become of him? Would you mind? Um... Where should I search? I'm not going to ask about a reward. Let's just, let's just help this poor guy out. Where should I look for your son? East of here. Midst the ruins of the fortress. He went there with some rogues from Pharaoh. Met him at the tavern. They filled his head with nonsense about some treasure. I said, Sonny, Pharaoh folk are liars to a man. You shouldn't fraternize with them. But he knew better. How'll I recognize him? All I know is he doesn't listen to his <laughs> father. Pretty typical for his age. His name's Olve. A cheerful lad. A bit of a lisp. Nothing special about his looks. Except last I saw him he was wearing a yellow tunic. Lovely. None other like it in the village. Got it from me a year back. On his birthday. That ought to do it. I'll look around. No promises though. Hmm, new quest contract missing son. Well, let's uh, see what's up with this one. Witcher contract missing son. Whoa, hoo, 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 suggested level 29. Well, good sir, I'm sorry to tell you this, but it will be a while before we look for your missing son. Sorry. Instead, we're going to continue on with this one, but first we're going to look at the, um, the uh, notice board over here. And we're going to talk. What is there a. Uh, what does this say, uh, Jana? Herbalist? Greetings. Greetings. Uh, got any on offer? Got any herb on you? Mind if I have a look at your herbs? Um, yeah, she's got herbs. I don't know. I don't think she has anything that we need. Nothing that I f find myself needing to craft stuff. Um, like for example. I don't need to make any of this stuff. Uh, to make this, I need... Oh, I need a di dimeridium bomb in order to make an enhanced dimeridium bomb. Same thing. Oh, with Northern Wind, I need some allspice. Let's see if she has allspice. Let's see. She does. Let's buy some allspice. Uh, we'll buy two of them. I do not need 13. Two. Okay, so we bought some of that. Now... Now that we've bought that, we should be able to make Enhanced Northern Wind. Let's make it. Okay, that's kind of cool. It's good to have that. Uh, Puffball, what do we need? We need some Rebus. Let's see if she has Rebus. Let's see. Uh, don't see any. No Rebus. Okay. And it's too bad we have to go back to this all the time. Um... Superior Dragon's Dream, we need Ether. And she does not have any Ether either. <laughs> See what I did there? Okay, 
let's see, since we're here, uh, we need, okay, for these we need specific mutagens, so she's not going to have any of those, I don't think, yeah, I like this music playing, you hear that, are you digging that, I like it, it's kind of, kind of spacey really, ooh, we need some mistletoe for this one, let's see if she has any mistletoe, I should be able to pin this, so if I hit Q, formula will now appear in shop panel. Okay, let's see how that works. Ooh, okay. We need a lesser red mutagen for that. Uh, we need uh, succubus mutagen, troll, wyvern, draconid oil. We need some ergo seeds. I'll pin that. Enhanced. You know, obviously, we need draconid oil before we can make the enhanced necrophage oil. Uh, we need some bear fat. Okay, Inspector Oil. We need Wolf's Liver. Okay. Superior Beast Oil. We need some Rubido. Oh gosh. Uh, we need, okay, for Superior Hydra Hydraginum. Uh, Devourer's Blood and Relict Oil. This one we just need Golden Oriole, uh, Maribar Forest, White Raffords. Uh, we need some Arenaria. Uh, again, we need Rebus and Vitriol. Oh, I can only I can only mark one thing at a time. You mean to tell me I'm just now noticing that as I mark something, it gets unmarked? <laughs> I can only I can only have one thing marked at a time. Well, shit. I didn't know that. Alright, whatever. I've lost interest in this now. Farewell. See ya. Fare thee well. Mm -hmm. your type a mile away. What? What the? What? Why would you say that? So I guess this is her little hut here. It's pretty nice. I mean, it's small, but, um, you know, got all the comforts of home. It's probably pretty cold in here, though. I don't see any place for a fire. Pretty cold, probably. All right, to the notice board. Okay, by all means. Uh, cunning man wanted. Whoops, I clicked on it and didn't read it. Sorry about that. Uh, Oivind fulfilled his pledge. Oivind carried out his pledge and strangled a boar with his bare hands. He died from his injuries three days later. Lift your horns and glasses in his memory. Okay. The Council of Elders' decision. The Council of Elders decrees that it is unbecoming that Renvig's sons and daughters should wear foreign clothes. Whoever notices a woman wearing continental lace, satin, or silk can tear them off her and to pieces then and there. Similarly, if a warrior starts dressing up in useless glittery armor or boots with golden buckles, he will be severely punished. What the hell? Disturbing portents. The druids have seen disturbing portents in the guts of a sac... S eh, scar official lamb. If you don't have to, don't go out to the sea for the next week and do not sign any contracts. And finally, nithing. I'm asking for help from any who can give it. Someone has cast a cruel and treacherous curse on my line for which I cannot find a remedy. If you've skill in undoing such charms, or even if you have heard of a worthy cunning man or peller who has such a gift, seek me out in my house near Rain Ranvig and rescue me from this misfortune. I shan't spare the coin and recompense Lotar. Okay. Okay, we well, un un unmarked whatever. Discovered some undiscovered locations. New quest, the Nithing. The Nithing? What the hell's a Nithing? Let's look at our quests. Switch our contracts. It was a contract, wasn't it? Or was it not? Well, maybe it wasn't. Maybe it's just a secondary quest. The Nithing. In Skellige, Geralt met a desperate and broken man named Lothar. Someone had cast a powerful curse on his son, causing him, to, causing him to slip closer and closer towards the grave with each passing day. The Witcher knew he had to lift the curse before it was too late. All right, well, this is a very low level, so we're going to switch to this one instead. Uh, Lothar is right down here. 
So, um, let us hop on... Uh, Roach. And, um, we'll travel on down there. Talk to Lothar and see if we can't help the park. Actually, we won't hop on Roach. It's really not that far away. So we'll just run over here. Get, get a little bit of exercise in. And uh, we'll take care of this level 14 quest. Okay. Right here. Nice little place. Who will I leave my home to reach out and eyes? Who will continue my line? What's going on, Lothar? How can I help you? <laughs> 